Mr. Jones, congratulations. How do you feel? I feel excited, man. It's a blessing to be part of this program, uh, the Kansas City Chiefs. Part of our brotherhood, uh, my family on the team. I was uh, there 20 minutes ago. I was unemployed, without a degree, three years out of college. Uh, a lot of mixed emotions going through the room. You know, family getting a call and family getting picked up by a team. Who'd you talk to on the phone? Uh, <clears throat> Ryan at first, then I talked to, uh, talked to the owner. General manager. Clock hunt. Yeah. Nice. Yes, did you tear up a lot? I did, man. It caught me off guard because, you know, I'm one of those manly type of guys. I don't cry. And, you know, you, uh, a lot of missed emotions going on and I finally getting that call. It was a blessing and the tears just came. What did the Chiefs say they expect from you next year? You know, they expect me to work hard, give it my all. They won't expect nothing but the best for me. And, uh, you know, I expect it for myself and that's when I want me to go. How disappointing was it to sit there all night last night and not hear any call? You know, um, <clears throat> I was thinking about that. You know, when um, when you get invited here, you always expect to go in the first round. And everybody have their expectation. They want to walk that stage before anybody. They want to be that guy to hug the commissioner first, and they want to get to hug the commissioner. And you know, um, everybody path is different, and everybody is drafted this place for a reason. The draft has already been done. It's already in God's plan. And you know, um, unfortunately, things don't work out as we always want them to work out. And, you know, the NFL, it's not just a race, it's a marathon. So it's not about who gets drafted first. It's about what they do wherever they get drafted at, you know? And I'm gonna make damn sure that wherever I get drafted at, I'm gonna leave my mark. Does it give you a little bit of a chip on your shoulder knowing that so many teams passed on you? Yeah, man. Uh, I go back to my high school days, man. Um, I became um, a nobody until a five-star in one game. And, you know, that was the Mississippi.